Good evening. Hello, hello. Good evening. Good evening. How's Good evening. everything there? Good evening. Can you listen to me perfectly? Yes. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Very good. So, well, we're going to be here during 60 minutes. Hope that you have been practicing English, as I said the last week. It's very important for you to oh, learn something new. Hello, what good evening, Ligia. Teacher, quiero decir de que debido a mi trabajo estaré de oyente el día de ahora. Okay, I got it. Thank you. You're welcome. Well, I can see Jorge, Maria, Jonathan, Carolina, Lenny, Lindaura, Joana, Sara, Roxana, yes. Leonel, Ligia, Liliana, Joana, uh, Joana Alas, right? Marcela Peñate, Marilyn, Jennifer, Catherine, eh, Maritza, and also Jacqueline. Also Jacqueline. Okay, welcome. I have 21 participants. That's quite good. And I hope the rest of the people can gather. Okay. Now, well, let us start by asking the famous question. Hey, what's new in English? What's new, people, in English? I learn a present continuous, the rules and no, stay verse. Stay verse. Okay. Good evening, Marcela. I got it. Okay, Sara, that was quite good. Okay, now some vocabulary, right? Is that right, Sarah? Yes. Yeah, pretty good. Thank you very much. Now, anybody else who wants to share something that you've learned lately? No more participants? Jorge? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. What's new in English, buddy? Uh, I learned the difference between going the words out and out. Uh, for example, uh -huh. out in the example, the apples are out of the boats. All right. And other example, outside. The outside. children play outside the house. Okay, very good. That was out and outside. Good. Thank you. That was quite good. Okay, Carolina. What's new in English, Carolina Reynosa? Is nothing's gonna stop me now <laughs> that that is part of the lyrics right yes <laughs> uh, i know i know because i have heard about that song starship right yeah in bueno, solo es. okay nothing gonna stop us now good chrissy what's new in english um, the word uh, is still. Uh, for example, I still love you. <laughs> uh, I still, uh, I still love you. All love right. Me. Other example: Are you still in your house? Are you in your house? Are you still in your house? Okay, good. Still, <laughs> good. New okay. word, right? Leo. What's new in English? Enrique. Leo, are you there? Well, we want to try with Lee here. Oh, let's try with, uh, with Roxana. Roxana, what's new in English? Uh, okay, teacher. In my case, I have been uh, learning idioms. For example, go bananas. Uh, okay. as as a <laughs> uh, what, what's the meaning of going 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 bananas? It, it's meaning is in Spanish is um volverse loco. <laughs> yeah, um also as mad as a harder is loco como una cabra. Okay. Uh, there 
uh, another is a cell like cell cell like hot cake is is meaning venderse como pan caliente. All right. And else cream of the crook cream of the croup. Um is uh, lo mejor de lo mejor. Excellent. Hey, good vocabulary, good expressions, Roxana. I hope you will never forget about them. I think it's very interesting, right? To to be like learning. Okay, Mindy, I got your message. Okay, I will take it into consideration. Thank you, Roxana. Well, we're gonna start with the class. Thank okay. Uh, hopefully we we do not face any technical problem. We're gonna go over a uh, close vocabulary, and after that, we're gonna see some information about uh, colors in English. Okay. But we will start with this info, people. Later, we are going to see some links so that we can um, increase the numbers of words, right? Remember, that's important for you to learn. Now, then you have the following vocabulary. Listen, please. Listen and repeat. It will be really nice. After you do this, please share. Hi, everyone. Can you listen? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. Good. Yes. Good. Here we go. Yes. yes. This class you'll learn clothes vocabulary, clothes which you wear for work and for leisure. As you can see on the screen, the clothes which are on the image towards the left hand side are for work, and the ones towards the right hand side are clothes for leisure. Let's practice by listening and repeating the vocabulary. Clothes for work. Here we go. Shirt. 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 Tie. Tie. Shirt. Belt. Tie. Belt. Belt. Jacket. Pants. Jacket. 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 Suit. 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 Shoes. Oh. Shoes. 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 Scarf. 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 High heels. High heels. High heels. High heels. High heels. Wrinkle. Wrinkle. For leisure. Hat. Hat. Sweater. Hat. Jeans. 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 Boots. Boots. Cap. T-shirt. 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 Socks. 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 Pajamas. You'll have pajamas. 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 Your turn to practice the now, before going to the next part, because we're going to see um, like a couple of verbs. Now, as you can see, the clothes um, are divided into categories over here. Clothes of work and clothes for leisure. Do you know the meaning of the word leisure? Exactly, all right. So it is it is different, right? So over here we have shirt. shirt. And the one that we wear for staying at home. T-shirt. So we have tie. 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 Belt. Belt. Jacket. 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 Coat, coat, Jeans, shirts, 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 the guy is going to present like two verbs that we can use regarding two vocabulary about clothes. 
And for example, the very one we, we have here is where. Okay. Where you don't I use wear. yeah but in Spanish then you say yo uso camisa manga larga no but in English the verb is wear wear okay I wear a tie for work I wear a tie for work yeah I wear shirt, shirt. at home I wear shirt at home so where is the verb over here now we're gonna see some more info about vocabulary okay I consider that the one that I will present is going to complement the information in the video. Well, actually clothes are items of clothing that people wear to, to cover their bodies. Okay, that's the meaning of the of that word. Okay, and as you can see, the wear is over here. Clothes are usually made of fabrics. Now, can you see the, the that vocabulary, please? Every single one I, I highlight, you're gonna you're gonna be in charge of looking for the meaning of it. Fabrics. What's the meaning? Fabrics. No. Fabrica. No, no, no. No, I mean go and look and sub the net. Sub the net. Uh, get a dictionary or maybe a translator, and then you tell me the meaning of that word. Fabrics. It's because it is not about fabrics. It's meaning tell us. Okay, so now we're talking. We're talking about, give me a second, please. Give me a second. Compañía? No, I mean, we have fabrics. Now you say, no, look for the meaning, please. It's telas. Yeah, because we're talking about clothes, right? If we're talking about clothes, we're talking about fabrics. We're talking also about fabrics such as cotton. Um, um. What is Lana. it? Algodon. Ah, it's okay. Algodon. All Algodon. right, so then we have wool. Lana. Or silk. Seda. meaning seda. Okay, they are often decorated with buttons, zippers, or Fasteners, upper yes. a tight clothing, clothing, and outfit that are some words that refer to clothes. Now we have a tight clothing and outfit it refers to the same word, right? It refers to to the word clothes. There are different kinds of clothing which depends on the gender, age, body type, location, season, occupation, religion, social status. And the purpose of query. Well, we have we have some more info over here, okay, that you are going to learn by how uh, you're gonna read later. I will share the link, but what really matters to me just right now is to put into practice what we have here. Now, how do you pronounce this word? Shirt. 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 Listen and repeat. Yeah. Give me a second, because I don't know why it is not it is not reproducing the sound. But we try once again. Shut. Ah, uh, now yes. Now do you listen? Shut. Shut. Okay. Jack Jacket. 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 Now, you know, you know trousers, right? Trousers. Trouser. Now, Trouser. jumper. Jumper. Coat. Coat. Jeans. Jeans. Sweatshirt. Sweatshirt. T-shirt. Sweatshirt. T-shirt. Polo T-shirt. Polo T-shirt. T-shirt. So, hoodie, 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 
Now pay attention because there is a slight difference between slippers, slippers. and also flip-flops. 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 Flip-flops.
He eats, wears, he wears. So we say he wears. She wears, it works. She works, it works. It works. She works, it works. Okay, so far so good? So hopefully we get, uh, I think you got the idea, right? Which is something that I consider quite important. Okay, about this vocabulary. So now we're gonna try to talk a little about colors, but besides colors, we're gonna talk a little also about a, a conversation, okay? We're gonna see the, the vocabulary over here. We're gonna repeat, okay? And later we're gonna see some extra info in the, in the web. Now do me the favor, pay attention. And they know if you wish. So because later I will ask you to tell me the conversation. Okay, here we go. Hi everyone. In this class, you'll learn the colors and you will practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real conversation. Let's start by looking at the image on the screen and listening to the colors. You should listen and repeat. White. White. Gray. White. White. Gray. White. White. Gray. Dark gray. gray. Dark gray. gray. Dark gray. Dark gray. Light, brown. Light, Light brown. brown. Light brown. Dark brown. Dark brown. Dark brown. Dark brown. brown. Red. 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 Pink. Red. 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 Pink. Orange, there are two questions Purple. over here like, hey, what are your favorite colors? And mm, the answer may be my favorite my colors favorite are red colors and purple. Are... Purple. 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 My favorite color is red and purple. Your favorite color is red? Yes. yes. <laughs> now, mention five things that are uh, in red color. Five things. Rojo. Rojo. Yeah. Okay, now, do me the favor. We're going to do the following. Okay. Now, what are your favorite colors? Is the questions. Okay. Okay. My favorite so, color is uh, green. A green. Okay. Now, if you say, for example, my favorite color is red. Si ustedes dicen, por ejemplo, mi color favorito es rojo, entonces me van a decir cinco cosas que sean rojas, como las fresas, oh. okay, como la sangre, como la jalea, okay, etc. Okay, so I will give you three minutes, three minutes, okay? So think about it, what is your favorite color? Then, name. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Think about it and think about five objects or five things that are in, in such color. My favorite color is blue. Blue, uh-huh. Five things that are in blue. Como las nubes. Uh, how do you say nubes in English? Sky. Uh, 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 the so, blue, so. like the sky, okay? Clouds is about nubes, right? Is water. Water. No, water. The sea. Okay, mar. two. The I need five. Cloud. Clouds. Okay, blue like clouds. Mm. 
Okay, Blue, sí. eh, sí, no, no, ahorita no, 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 no sé cómo pronunciar lo que tengo en mente. Uh, uh, look for it, please. Búsquenlo en la, en, en, en la web, por favor. Ok, now, let's see. I need only two people. Solo necesito dos personas que participen en esta parte. My favorite... Ok, Joana, color, Stephanie. My favorite color is pink. Pink. Uh, uh -huh. Pink? Uh -huh. Pink. Uh, uh, the pink. Pink. Okay. Okay. Um, but is pink is color pink. Uh -huh. Okay, thank you. Now we have Carolina. Okay, thank you very much, Joana. Carolina, go ahead. And after yes, Carolina, and, and my color favorite is yellow, for example, X, X, but. Sunflowers, beer, and light. Creo que es la luz. Uh -huh. Okay. And... ¿Sí? Okay, thank you. Thank you, Carolina. Let's listen to Jorge. Uh, good evening. Good evening. My favorite color is blue. Like the color of the flag, like the sky, like my wife, A. Like the, oh. sea in the, like the sea and like the sunset. Okay, very good. Hey, like your wife's eyes. Oh. <laughs> it's oh. not blue, it's brown. Uh, they're, uh, they're, be careful, they're brown. Okay. <laughs> it's for the gym. <laughs> okay, very good. Now you got it, right? Now let's continue. Let us try to practice the conversation, people. Now. We're going to listen and repeat. Good evening. Uh, hello? Hello, hello? Sara? No, no for you. No, no. Is there anybody else who no, wants to Jessica. participate? Jessica, go ahead, Jessica. Jessica. Ah, uh, sí, ese was my favorite color is a green. Apple mm -hmm. green, true light, true lip, to watermelon outside. Okay, perfect, right? There are many things that are green. The leaves of the trees, the lemons, um, the pears, pears, uh, the watermelon. Okay, but you know, watermelon is like red, right? On the, on, outside. Outside, uh, outside so. the watermelon is green. Okay, very good. Len, Lenny. Thank you very much. Thank you. Good evening. Good evening. Lo voy a intentar. Eh, Try. My favorite color is uh, green. Pink. In my house, in my boot, in my uh, utensilios de cocina. Utensilios okay. de cooking, de, co de chicken. Okay. Quite good. Okay, so. Teacher, may I? Uh, sure, Roxana, go ahead. Okay, uh, in my case, same to same Carolina, my favorite color is yellow. For example, song, the, uh, um, the, to, uh, the yellow tulip, and some flower and the uh, orange, but no, it's the color yellow, no. And um, that's it. Okay. Now, uh, how do you say utensilio de cocina? Then you say cookware. For the person you who, can... cookware. Cookware. Yeah, okay, so that was quite good. And also the information Roxana presented. Thank you for being there, like participating actively. I really like that. Now, let us see the a conversation. What do you think the ladies are doing? ¿Qué creen que están haciendo las, las, las 
ladies, las damas acá. What are you doing? Ah, no, sobre no, la no, ropa. Discutiendo sobre la ropa. How do dry, you... the, dry the clothes. Oh, Now, how do you say discutir in English? Oh. Uh -huh. Ajá. Discussion? No. No. <laughs> Not really. Argo? Uh, argue. Uh, they are argue. arguing, argue. right? They're arguing okay. about about uh, a problem that I facing with the with the clothes, right? So especially this lady, right? How do you describe this lady? How do angry. You uh, she's angry. Okay. She's angry. She's, she's angry. angry. And what about this lady? Uh, uh, how do you say that in English? A pen? This is ashamed. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Ashamed about something she did. Now we're going to go over the conversation itself. Okay. Here we go. Listen and repeat. Illustrate how colors are used to describe colors, clothing. Right? Let's listen and repeat. Great, our clothes are dry. Where is my new blouse? What color is it? It's white. Here's a light blue blouse. Is it yours? No, it's not mine. Wait, it is mine. It's a disaster. Oh, no. All our clothes are light blue. Here's the problem. It's these new blue jeans. Whose jeans are they? Uh, they're mine. Sorry. What I would like for you to do next is to practice this conversation. If you have a partner with whom you can practice with, that will be great. If it's just you, I would still encourage you to practice on your own which illustrates how colors are used to describe clothing. Now we're going to repeat. Let's listen and repeat. Great. Our clothes are dry. Uh-huh. Great. 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 Our clothes are dry. Our clothes are dry. Okay. It seems, it seems very simple. Mm -hmm. like, like to listen to, fíjense que cuando yo les digo, Presten atención y repitan. Es muy sencillo, ¿verdad? Pero si yo les digo, presten uh, atención, suma atención de cómo se pronuncian cada palabra, entonces eso es un poquito diferente, ¿no? Porque, digo, great, our, si yo digo or, yo solo digo or. No. Que y este no es or. No. This is our. Um, okay, now our. I will play once again. Our. 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 Listen once our. again. Listen, listen. Great. Our clothes are dry. Uh huh. Great. 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 Our clothes are dry. Our clothes are dry. Our clothes are dry. Are dry. Okay. okay. Our our clothes are dry. Our clothes are dry. Our clothes are dry. Our clothes are dry. Listen carefully. Listen carefully. Escucho que algunos dicen or todavía. Or, or, or. No, our. Our Listen carefully. Here we go. Next part. Where is my new blouse? Where is my new blouse? Now, once, once again, listen carefully. It's because you need to pay special attention to the way you are pronouncing. Where or where? Where. 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 Now, where. 
were, 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 were. No, sounds, were. sounds the same. Suenan iguales. Were or were? Maybe. No, <laughs> really. No, no, no. <laughs> no, no. It's because. Where? Let's see. Se va a encontrar con esta pregunta. Hey, where were you born? ¿Dónde naciste? Más adelante se van a encontrar con él. Where were you born? Where, 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 Great, our clothes are dry. Uh huh. Great, our clothes are dry. Great, our clothes are dry. Where is my new blouse? Where is my new blouse? Where is my new blouse? Listen. What color is it? What, what color, color is, is, is it? What color is it? What color is it? What color is it? Color is it? It's, it's white. It's, it's, it's white. 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 It's white. white. It's 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 white. Yeah, make emphasis in the pronunciation once again, right? Okay, because some of you the uh, is it's it's it. It's 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 white. Yeah, it's white. 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 Listen. Here's a light blue blouse. Is it yours? Here's a light blue Here's a light blue blouse. Here's yours. a light blue blouse. Is it yours? Is it yours? Is it yours? Yours. Hey, here is a light blue blue blouse. Is it yours? Wow. Here's light blue here's blouse. Here. Here. Is it yours? Listen. Is it yours? Is it yours? No, it's not mine. No, no it's not, not mine. mine. Wait. 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 It's a disaster. It is mine. It's a disaster. 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 No. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh no, all our clothes are like blue. 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 Now, when, when, I fin oh, when we finish, when we finish, I will ask two people to read it. The best they can. Okay, listen. Here's the problem. It's these Here's new the blue jeans. Whose jeans are they? Here's, Here's, Here's the problem. It's the blue jeans. New blue jeans. Whose jeans are they? Whose jeans are they? Okay. They're mine. 
Sorry. Sorry. What I would like to do? Oh, Sorry. 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 Oh, they are mine. Sorry. Sorry. Hi, sorry. Oh, they are more sorry. Now, remember, recuérdense que tienen una tarea, ¿ok? Todavía no la vamos a, a ver. El día de mañana, si Dios permite, la vamos a estudiar. Pues ese valiente, such as mine. Sorry. Pues ese... Eh, bueno, such as yards. Yours. Mine. Mine. Mine once again here. Mine. And mine over here. So, mine. well, yeah, to, tomorrow we're going to go over some, some uh, topics about possessives in English, okay? So, I, I will ask to, to participants to read the information, to read the conversation. Then we're going to move to something else. Uh, well, I need to listen to Jonathan Ulises and Joanna Stephanie, please. Okay, great. Our, our clothes are dry. Where is my the blues? Blows? What color is it? It's a what? It's why? Here's a light blue blouse. Is it yours? No, it's not my. Wait, it is my. It's a this this sir. Oh no! All our clothes are light blue. Her the problem it's this new blue blue jeans. Who who said jeans are they? Oh, they're mine. Sorry. Hello. Hello, hello. You finish. I finish. Oh, oh you finish, right? <laughs> so. I finish. Yeah, so we have here the following, right? So pronunciation, say here, here. and here. 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 Something here. else. Who's? 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 Okay, so you see. Who's? 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 Why? Hey. Now see, here, here's the problem. Is this the here's the problem. Here's the problem. Whose genes are they? Whose genes are, are they? Excellent. Okay. Are they? So I want you to learn. Quiero que aprendan a prestar mucha atención a cualquier um, recurso que se les presente en inglés, porque eh, lo, si lo van a aprender, deben aprenderlo de la manera correcta. Entonces. Quiero que aprendan que cuando no está el teacher, cuando no estoy yo y ustedes están aprendiendo algo en casa, asegúrense de pronunciarlo bien, de escucharlo bien y de pronunciarlo bien. ¿Ok? okay. Eso es otro hábito que quiero que queden ustedes. Now. Hmm. I have more info here about clothes when well, I will go over this uh, a little bit quickly. I will share the links that I have here so that you can like notice about the the information that we are um that, that I am uh, sharing. Okay. 
just in case we do not see everything I have here, what you have, the links, and you will be able to uh, have some, some review. Well, we have been talking about clothes, right? Uh, but we haven't even uh, defined the word itself. And, you know, if we talk about clothes, clothes, we say that clothes are items of clothing that people wear to cover their wear body. clothes or items. Clothes, clothes are usually clothes. made of fabrics. What's the meaning of the word fabrics? Fabrics. 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 What's the meaning? Tela. Okay. Tela. Fabrics such as cotton. 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 Wool. Wool. Or, 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 or seals. Or seals. Or seals. Or seals. They often decorated with buttons, zippers, or other fasteners. Apparel, attire, clothing, and outfit are some words that refer to clothes. There are different kinds kinds of clothing, which depends on the gender, age, body type, location, season, occupation, religion, social status, and the purpose of wearing. Mm -hmm. OK, so then we have what well, you are going to encounter a lot of here, OK, such as vocabulary, shirt. such as shirt, shirt. jacket, jacket, yes, yes. Trousers. 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 You know, trousers. Trousers. Jumper. 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 Coat. 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 Jeans. 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 Sweatshirt. 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 No, this is sweatshirt. not sweet. Sweet. It's sweat. Sweatshirt. 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 No, this is not sweet. This is soot. 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 Hoodie. Hoodie. Dress. 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 Scarf, 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 hat, hat, hat. bra, bra, and the word, boots, 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 shoes, shoes, shoes. Slippers. slippers, slippers, flip flops, flip flops, flip flops, sneakers, sneakers, tie, tie, and bow tie. Oh, tie. Oh, tie. Now, something else I want you to notice is about, about the categories, right? That we may have regarding the clothing. Men's clothing, unisex clothes, and also we have women's clothing. Okay? Women's clothing. All right. So, uh, we're going to stop uh, uh, talking a little about, about clothes. You have more information about it, right? So, but we're gonna go over also to the part that's that's about colors in English. Colors in English, right? So colors in English, we have some vocabulary. We're, gonna, we're not gonna see those videos, but we're gonna see like the ones that are over here. What color is this one? Black. 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 Brown. 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 No. no, you don't say brown, you say brown. 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 Gray. 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 
white white white, white. 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 Now, listen some of you say why why no why is the question word right white 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 yellow 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 Orange. 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 Red. 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 Pink. Green. Pink. Green. Pink. Pink. Purple. 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 Blue. 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 Green. 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 Now, there is, there is some info that you should take into consideration. And like, for example, what is the difference between gray and gray? Now, the same as with the difference between color and color. You see, color, color. It depends on the country, depende del país, okay? So if you are in the United States, están en Estados Unidos, you say gray. Yes, gray, gray con A, gray. But if you are in some other countries, English-speaking countries like England, Australia, Canada, and more other than you use gray. Right. Es el mismo color, okay? Pero depende, ¿verdad? Si están en Estados Unidos, lo escriben con A. Si están en otro país, lo escriben con E. What order with colors? Well, we have the verb to be. We have the color. And they say, my car is blue. As you can see, ya vimos los adjetivos, ¿verdad? Entonces, los, los colores también son adjetivos. The blue car is mine. Blue is the color of my car, etc. So then we have uh, light, dark, and bright. Tenemos otras categorías como light blue, blue, blue and dark blue. blue. Dark blue. We have light green, 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 green and dark green. green. And dark, and dark green. green. You will encounter some other examples such as, hey, Helen has dark green eyes. His light gray hair made him look very dis distinguished. Her bright pink lipstick doesn't look good. Now, and you have more, right? So fortunately, we got this, the uh, link so that you can have like um, some, some info. Now, we have red. Okay, so. Si nosotros nos adentramos con cada tema, bien pudiéramos irnos nada más como rojo, naranja, amarillo, verde, azul, ok. Pero si nosotros vemos como otros ejercicios o vemos, estudiamos a detalle esta página, nos vamos a dar cuenta que además de aprendernos el color, podemos aprendernos otro vocabulario. What color are strawberries? Red. Ah, Red. ok, strawberry. Now, what color are roses? Red. 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 What color is a fire engine? Red. Red. What color is a black? Red. Red. What color is the hot? Red. 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 Heart. 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 Yeah, heart. Oh. What color are the pumpkin? Pump pumpkins. Orange. 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 Right. Carrot. Orange. 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 Basketball. Orange. Orange. Okay. Orange. Now, how many new words? ¿Cuántas palabras nos hemos aprendido al unirlas o a relacionarlas con los colores? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Solo con dos colores. Imagínense todo el vocabulario que pudiéramos um, recoger a través de este tema. Ok, por eso, por eso se los dejo por ahí el enlace, ok, para que ustedes sigan enriqueciendo su conocimiento. We're going to try to finish, vamos a tratar de finalizar con esto, entonces ustedes me van a ir eh, digitando en el chat los colores que escuchan, ok. Play. Ok. Ok. En el chat, please. Thank you. Thank you. I got it, right? Listen to the next one. Listen to the next one. Green. Okay. 
Listen to the next one. Orange. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Give me a second. Let me see. Uh -huh. No, crazy. I mean, you need to you need to type it the way it is written down. Orange. Red. Uh-huh. Okay, you got it. That's called that's this red color. Next one. Pink. Type it please. Okay, you have pink. Have pink. Purple. Okay, very good. I think you are familiarized with the with the with the topic, right? Black. Okay. Yellow. Good, Maritza. No, let me see. Okay, Roxana, you got it, right? Yellow. Gray. We discovered that we have two ways to say gray, right? Brown. Okay, Joanna got it. That's brown. Brown. And the last one is white. 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 We're going to check it. I think gray is because, well, you see, this is America, right? So we need to, we need to check it again. Okay, good. So we got the 100%. You see, 100%. Well, now let me see. Okay, very good. Now, we're almost done. Uh, I would I would really appreciate to look for information about possessives. Recuérdense que tienen una tarea pendiente relacionada a los posesivos. Okay? Possessive. Ese es un tema que vamos a abordar mañana y quiero que estén familiarizados con el mismo. Eh, por ahí les dejé los enlaces que utilicé esta noche. Okay, hay uno que está... Es nada más extra information y pues no lo abordé porque pues es nada más de que ustedes lo vean, lo, uh, se aprendan quizás a palabras nuevas de esa página y pues ya mañana seguiríamos con, con algo más que son los possessives, ¿ok? Possessives es un tema que yo necesito que quede muy bien establecido al inicio de los cursos. Estamos a la semana 3, en la otra semana cerramos el nivel y ya ustedes pasarían a otro nivel. Entonces, deben estar preparados para lo que se viene. ¿De acuerdo? ¿Les parece si nos quedamos por acá? Ok. 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 Sí, okay. este Good night, Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you later. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night.